We're at level 404, and all we have is these three characters. <laughs> now we have 733,000 black eggs. Unbelievably good stuff. All right, we just started this run 20 minutes ago, and we're at level 400. Right now, progress on to the next level, 997. This took so, so long. This is probably the best thing you can upgrade in the entire game. This speeds up your run so hard. We're gonna retire and spend a million black eggs right here at the end. What is going on, my bacon men and my bacon women? My name is Joe, and welcome back to another episode of Egg Hatching Simulator. <sighs> Today we're back here for an episode that's gonna go down in the egg hatching simulator. Today is gonna be the biggest grind we've ever done on this game, period. All right, I'm so excited to finally begin this video and also incredibly sad to begin this video because I know I'm gonna have to play for like 20 hours straight to achieve what I wanna achieve. Today, we are going to get back on that top leaderboard and uh, the thing is the top leaderboard is a lot harder now to get onto. You can go ahead and uh, scroll all the way down here to the bottom and you can see just to make it into the top one you have to hit level 1230, which is a lot of levels. What? But as you guys know, in our last videos, we have done so much grinding to get into a position where we should be able to achieve this in, honestly, I hope a day. I, if it takes any longer than a day, then this is gonna be rough. But it's time to solidify our position on that board, all right? So today, we will be doing the best we can physically grind in today's video. Go ahead and drop a like on the video and subscribe if you have not already and turn on post notifications because that way you will always be alerted if there is a new video. And if you're here in the first minute, let me know down in the comments down below right now and I'll go and favorite some of those comments. Anyway, let's go ahead and begin our massive expedition. So right here, we are at level 605 and you might be thinking, Joe, you're already pretty close to your goal, but I'm actually not going to be using this run. I'm actually going to be restarting this very soon. I I think probably within the next 15 levels I will restart this it's because I have a lot of pending black eggs and I really want those for my next run because at the moment we only have 8,490 black eggs which might sound like a lot but into the comparison of 300,000 that we're gonna get it's really not a ton so the goal is to just get these last couple of mutated bosses I think I only want to make it to like 615 because these bosses at this level give huge amounts of mutated eggs all right so I think what we'll first do get to those levels very simply and then we will really begin our run once we have those. All right, so we made it to the boss we want to fight, and it doesn't look like he's mutated, so that's definitely a negative, but hey, we're still gonna go ahead and do our retirement anyway. I want to start this video off with a fat kick. So let's go ahead and retire this sucker, all right? We'll get 283,000 black eggs, which is phenomenal for our first one, and uh, let's go ahead and start this. So a couple small tips, because some of you guys were saying, like, in games that I was joining, like, do you have any tips for how to play and stuff? And if you're really looking to amplify how fast you can do everything, there is like a couple of things that really help with cutting down on seconds and everything. Because if you're paying a lot of full attention, you can make your runs really fast. One of the first ones is just getting a VIP server and always choosing this farm, the one that is closest to this chicken man. Because what happens then, if you need to make it to that chicken man, it's a very short run away. But also if you claim this one, you can just jump off and then you will spawn right here back at the characters. It's a really fast way to cut down on time. I think throughout this video, we'll kind of give some kind of tips on stuff here and there, just so you guys kind of have a vague idea of some cool stuff. We have a lot to talk about today, but I don't really want to just keep uh, this intro going, so I'm going to go ahead and catch you guys up, maybe when we're at a cool little milestone. All right, we are here with the first update of many, and <laughs> what an interesting run this has been. We're on Retirement 16 and Rebirth 2, and uh, we're at level 404, and all we have is these three characters. <laughs> I guess four because we have Pai Mei, but um, we got way too many black eggs apparently because I have barely needed to upgrade anything besides these guys. These guys just go to town destroying and it's only been 20 minutes. All right, we just started this run 20 minutes ago and we're at level 400 and I haven't had to buy any other characters except these initial three, which is so funny. Right now, we almost have enough cash to buy Michael Jordan already and we haven't even bought past Robin Hood. 
good, which is just ridiculous. And it's all because of this egg right here, the Fabre egg or the Faberge. I don't know how you say this. Basically, it just increases the amount of eggs that get dropped by a significant margin. Right now, I have 1,180% more eggs dropped, which is massive. And not only that, but then I have it so all the farmers leveling costs less. So basically, I'm getting so many buffs that allow me to upgrade my characters faster while getting more money faster. And so I have to spend less money on new characters. And actually, this might be a new meta for trying to level up quickly because I've had to do significantly less work. Like this is fully turned into an AFKable game. I just have to occasionally like click on my screen and just upgrade a max like that. And it helps so much. You can even see that all the bosses get finished so quickly. All the normal chickens just go right away. I guarantee with this setup, we could probably make it into level 700, 800 with this. Like I really don't see this ever stopping being a good method. It's just that except when you start getting a lot higher, the damage starts getting higher and higher. So these guys do less and less damage. You know what I mean? Because even though you can keep four times in their damage, eventually the chickens start having so much health that you need the stronger characters. But for right now, it is working so well. I have to do a lot less work than I was actually imagining I would have to do, which is great because that way that I can just sit here, listen to some anime music and just watch some chickens die. But honestly, though, it is kind of nice to have like a break because normally this game, I'm constantly running back and forth from spawn, buying the new characters, buying all their upgrades and everything. And this way I can just chill here. See like, oh, we're killing this boss kind of slow. Let me just go ahead and upgrade him a little bit. We'll kill him faster. I don't know. So far, this is a phenomenal method. Like we are just not going to change up our meta at the moment. Uh, probably next time you guys see me, I probably will have more characters just because like some of them hella upgrade our stuff. Like one guy gives you like an 100% more eggs, which would be really helpful to have right now. But I don't know. I'm I just see how far I can really make it on just these three guys because uh, we're doing work with them. But anyway, I will catch up with you guys when we get even closer to our goal. Guys, update and a half here. All right, we're at level 747 and uh, this news is probably going to shock you guys. Uh, so I'm deciding to retire here actually, which you guys are like, oh my god, but your run is so good so far. Uh, and you know, it is. It is honestly going very good so far and I can definitely, definitely make it to the the level that I want to, but here's my thought process. If we want to make it to a very high level, then we're going to need a lot more black eggs than we have now. Even though we have a ton, not to say we don't have a lot or anything, it's just that it, when we're trying to compete to get onto the top leaderboards, we're going to need more black eggs than this just to be able to beat these chickens faster. Not to say we're beating them slowly whatsoever, it's just that, it, just like I said at the beginning of this video, these three guys brought us to like level 350? No, actually it was like 450. It was just so long ago. I already forgot. But now that I'm already at this level, I need every single character. Like, I, I have to do it to be able to reach that level. And so I feel like if I go ahead and double up on my black eggs, these three characters alone would be able to bring me to this level. And that's a that's a big deal. So this may mean a lot more time commitment for me since we are getting close to getting on the leaderboard. I just don't want to stop halfway short, all right? I want to get a really, really dope video for you guys and get a dope level here. So we're going to go ahead and retire once more. God Dang it, I can't believe I'm even doing this. This is an absurd amount of black eggs that we're gonna get here. But actually, you know what? It might just make sense to try to fight one more boss here, all right? That would save us. Like, because if we actually get lucky and there is a mutated boss, we'll be very happy. All right, we were unlucky. The Ticks chicken boss is not mutated. All right, let's go ahead and <laughs> retire once more. Oh my Jesus. <laughs> we're doing so many retirements, it's unhealthy. All right, that is our 17th retirement right there. Two more gold eggs added to our next rebirth. Very nice. Now we have 733,000 black eggs. Unbelievably good stuff. All right, so the couple of things I wanted to talk about briefly for a second is that the, some of these eggs are just god tier. All right, the Fabre is phenomenal. And I think I'm going to go ahead and upgrade this a lot. I think I'm going to do this. Hmm, what do I want to do here? I obviously am not going to do a thousand percent, but like I might do, I think I'm going to do a hundred here because that will really help our run out because now we get a 1600 increase there. And I think all also, I'll upgrade the garbage as well because this makes everything cheaper because this really helps alongside uh, getting the boost in eggs. And then one of these other ones, I think it's not the idol. Uh, no, no, it is the idol. All right, so this one makes it so we actually get to kill less chickens, which is phenomenal. That'll make it so I have to kill two and a half less chickens every single time. So that's way more helpful than you guys think. But we're going to go ahead and nab Tarzan here. He does 691,000 damage at level one. <laughs> that is unreal. So we'll go ahead and buy that egg, 
pragmatic, and uh, it's gonna start grinding us some eggs here. This is gonna be great. All right, now begins the true grind to the highest level we will ever reach in this game. Let's do this, my friends. All right, everyone, this is finally uh, the very big moment. All right, so here we are at level 996, and we can right now progress on to the next level, 997. This took so, so long. And so at the beginning of the video, I was really optimistic that I'd be able to do this in a couple of hours, but that's not the case whatsoever, because the further you get into the game, it gets exponentially harder and these like far on levels are insanely difficult they just take so long but we are coming up on level 1000 all right and this is a big moment i've obviously never hit this level this is the highest level i've ever hit in level 999 and uh we're gonna go ahead and do the big boss fight here i'm expecting something good so let's see it all right we get a mutated chicken boss who is it is it like a sapphire sapphire or something well i don't know but we beat it anyway and we got 27,000 black eggs eggs and uh hmm i just noticed it's looping the chickens we've had amethyst chickens before but now we are at level 1001 all right i was kind of hoping that would be a little bit more epic i was like because like level 1000 is really really high up like i was hoping for something a little unique all right but here is my opinion about this stage all right this stage is so hard all right the only reason we're even doing slightly good is because ang is near level 2000 and that's the only reason why otherwise this run is not going too fast. I think I've been doing this exact run for about eight or nine hours now of like consistent playing. That's like full on paying attention. Very little AFKing. I only got to AFK for probably like the first hour or two. Then the rest of it, I had to be paying full attention. But a lot has actually happened. I retired one other time and I didn't even show you guys uh, just because I just wanted to get it out of the way. I needed more black eggs to be able to hit this level in a reasonable amount of time. Uh, so we right now have a million black eggs and that's after we upgraded a ton of things we upgraded our Fabre egg to give us 2680 percent more eggs and then we upgrade our newton egg to give us 15,000 more eggs from exceptions what else did we upgrade we updated our present so we can get higher chance of 10 times eggs we got uh what else did we do i can't really remember all the ones we did i know we did idle a little bit so now we have a guaranteed chance of only having to kill seven chickens instead of like uh half eight half seven you know and believe it or not this is probably the best thing you can upgrade in the entire game. This speeds up your run so hard. All right, like it's so amazing. So this is, I highly recommend getting that one upgraded and I highly recommend upgrading this one. Obviously this one is amazing. But right now we have 1.1 million pending black eggs, which is pretty great. So I'm stuck in this kind of limbo of not wanting to uh, retire again because obviously we just made it to level 1000 and that's a huge milestone. But here's the thing, I know for for sure these next 300 levels that i need to get to are going to take mountains of time all right because we're just really not at a stage we don't have enough black eggs for this to be something we can obtain very quickly. And since I want to get this episode out for you guys, we're going to go ahead and retire here. I know, I know, I know. We didn't achieve our goal for today's video, all right? We're going to get it done. It's just not obtainable in this exact video. But still, to be able to kind of end this video with a bang, because I really want to have something exciting here, we're going to retire and spend a million black eggs right here at the end, all right? So I'm going to go ahead and retire real quick. This is actually super saddening. Like, I hate that I'm even retiring right now because i've never made it to anywhere near a thousand so that's amazing all right but now we have 2.1 million black eggs which is god tier seriously so good so now let's go ahead and spend a million i'm kind of excited to see what we could buy here so with this we can increase tornado a lot we can make it last twice as long uh you know what i think i'm just gonna upgrade this one very slightly we'll just add 20 seconds to tornado that's pretty good uh this one's really good this gives us more exceptions and honestly, the name of the game at this point is getting more exceptions and increasing the amount of eggs dropped. So I think I'll increase this one by about 100,000 there. So that will really help us. We've hardly upgraded this one at all, but this is really good as well, actually. I don't know why I haven't really upgraded this. This will increase our critical attack damage by 1,500%. <laughs> That's really good. So far, we've, all, we've only spent like 150,000 black eggs. We haven't really spent too much just yet. So um, boss HP. This is 
is the one where I don't know why this is so good. Like, so many people have been saying to upgrade this, so I'm gonna do it just to kind of please all the people who say this is good, but I don't feel like this is that good of a thing. All it does is decrease the boss's HP slightly, not even by, like, a huge margin or anything, so I'm not gonna upgrade that one too much. I'm just gonna, like, upgrade this one again for the novelty. Like, this thing's not too good, but I might as well do it anyway just because it was level one. All right, this is the one I'm thinking of upgrading a lot because if we upgrade this one again, then it makes it so we have to kill 3.11 less chickens per level, which is really, really good. The only thing is it costs 131,000 black eggs to do it, which is a lot, obviously. The only other one I'm contemplating upgrading over this would be the garbage egg, which despite its name, it's actually amazing because we could do this level almost twice. Yeah, we can do this level twice and that's just going to help us out so much. It decreases the cost by 15%. That's amazing. And then the only other thing I'm thinking of upgrading a lot is the Faberet. This thing is so good and uh, there we go. We just spent, I think that's 700,000 black eggs that we've already spent so far, but everything is super upgraded. Let's go ahead and upgrade the 10 times chance of eggs. And honestly, with that, that's almost a million. We only have about 100,000 black eggs left to spend. But now we have a 4% chance of 10 times eggs, which is kind of the lifesaver late in the game. It's really good. I guess the one that we should upgrade a lot is the mutated boss eggs, because like we don't do that one that often. So now we have a 25% chance. So every four bosses, we should 100% get a mutated boss. All right, so that was a lot of upgrades that we've just done there. Uh, so that is going to conclude today's video. Video. All right, we got a phenomenal amount of work done. We still have a lot more to do in this game. I want to make it into those top charts, baby. All right, it just takes a long, long, long time. In these next couple days, I would really like to obtain that. It just takes an absurd amount of time. So I'll update you guys in another video, and hopefully we will hit those top leaderboards. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this one. If you did, drop a like down below and subscribe. I would greatly appreciate it. And I will see you guys tomorrow for another Roblox video. See you later, guys.